Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. And today I'm gonna to be sharing with you a swap that I participated in. This swap was hosted by Esther Luca. She does have a channel. I will leave her link down below. If you guys are not familiar with her, she does host swaps every once in a while. She also does hauls and project shares and she's super sweet. I've been subscribed to her for quite some time and I love and enjoy participating in her swaps. This one here was her Christmas winter themed one. And I was actually partnered up with Jasmine. She goes by Polish and Glitter here on Instagram. So if you guys um, have an IG account, I will leave her link down below because I believe Jasmine does not have a YouTube channel. But if she does, um, I will link that down below as well. So this is what she sent me. Um, one of my last videos, I did show you guys a hoop um, mail or hoop share loaded hoop that I did and that was for her she did already receive receive that and everything else that was included in the swap and this is what she sent me cute cute big box I'm absolutely loving it and everything is packaged so adorable she also decided to do an advent calendar for me we were able to choose a there was a couple options I know one was hoop mail um, the advent calendar and maybe a journal I'm not sure but there were certain things that we did have to include in the swap. And this is what she created for me. I've never received nor made an advent type um, goodie box for anybody. So this is super cool. It's a new experience. And I'm definitely going to learn from her ideas. So this is the card she made me. Super adorable. I've already read it, Jasmine. And I'm so happy you loved everything I sent you. And no worries. This came late. It's not a big deal. We all have other priorities, so no worries. I'm excited to get into this. So there is a tag that she put on top of here as well, just to indicate what exactly is in each of the baggies. There are a total of 25, which is cool, because sometimes um, you're not sure on what's inside. So, and then this did have like the little pom-pom trim attached to it, but it fell off, but I'm definitely gonna be using that. So that is cool. Um, I kind of did a little peek through everything. The bags are not in order, so I'm just going to be grabbing them as like in a row, I guess. But it is filled to the max. And I'm going to be totally using this crinkle paper because it's pink and white and that's my favorite. So the first one is actually number one. And I just love the rosettes that she put on every bag. It's so cute. I can reuse these. I'm just so excited. Um, this one is, let's see, it says it's a confetti mix. And they're actually like in um, little plastic containers. So I'm just going to leave them in here for now. I don't want to mess up the packaging. But that is baggy number one. So excited. You guys know I love confetti mixes, especially for shakers. This one is number 10, and number 10 is a face mask. Comes with 30 little um, sheets, and I can just take these off. It's perfect. Oh my gosh, look how cool is that? Who doesn't love face masks? They're like little eye zone ones that you can put under your eyes if you wake up and you have bags under your eyes. So cool. Thank you. Um, let's see, this one is... Number three, she packaged up a bunch of doilies. Oh my gosh, this is totally something that could be used for so many different projects. Again, loving the rosette that she included on here. Absolutely adorable. Love those. Uh, let's see here. Number 15 is handmade cards. Oh, that was one of the ones that we had to do as well. I am not that creative when it comes to handmade cards. Um, let's see if we can take a quick peek. I like how she wrapped that up too. Oh, look at this one. Peace and joy. So cute. Love that. I'm going to need in some more um, Christmas cards because I've been receiving some. So this is perfect. I can just send these back to other friends. Look at this one with the little ball ornaments. How cute is that? And then this one. Aw, how cute. Merry Christmas with the little Santa. 
That is so cute. Thank you so much, Jasmine. These will come in handy for sure. Um, this one is number eight. And they're just some cute little floral stickers. Absolutely love. You can use these all year round. And I think these are from the Dollar Tree. And I just love the packaging. Such a cute job. And number nine. Or is that number six? Let's see. Um, no, I think this is number nine. Planner stickers. So cute. A bunch of different planner stickers. Oh my gosh. And I think this is like a little sticker book inside. Oh wow. Definitely can be using that. This one is number 12. And it just looks like a bunch of different pieces of ribbon. And trim. We got some pom poms, some lace. How pretty! Love that. Ooh, that's one is so cute. Love that. And then, okay, so this one will be. This is number six, which is the hot cocoa packets. Such a cute little idea. Love that. Thank you so much. And then. Number 13 is wrapped, and oh, so one of them that we also had to include was a homemade ornament, so this is the one she made for me. I'm going to go ahead and open it up. Ooh. <gasps> O-M-G. Look at this. It says create. Oh my gosh. I absolutely Love this. Oh, this is so cute. I'm going to hang this all year round in my craft room. And there's another one in here. Oh, my gosh. Did you make these? It reminds me of the Ray Dunn. Oh, my gosh. I love these. These are so cute. Oh, wow. Thank you so much, Jasmine. Those are adorable. Oh, my gosh. Way better than what I created. <laughs> I was not, I'm not that best with it comes to ornaments. Oh my God, I love that. It's so cute. Um, let's see, this one's number 18. And this one says it's journaling cards. So just a bunch of different journaling cards. Absolutely love it. I'm loving the gold bags that you're using too. I'm gonna try to save everything. <laughs> oh my gosh, so cool. Thank you. Um, here's number seven. And number seven, it looks like a bunch of, um, it's tags, but you got some paper tags, you got some chipboard, some thick tags here as well. Wow. Absolutely love it. Thank you. And this one is number 21. This is like a little, or 22. And this one is like a journaling notebook. It's just like a little Christmas. Oh, I wonder, did you alter this? Or did it just come that way? And look at she made like a little belly band. That is so cute. Oh, I think it's just it came this way unless she unless you decorated it, but just a cute little Christmas note bag. That is cool. This is something that I can use when you know to jot down, you know, what I'm getting for people for Christmas and all that. So that is so cute. And I love the paper. Thank you so much. And okay, so number five, I would say is it probably the um, ribbon came on here too as well. Just a box of cookies. Look at this cute little tin here. So cute. Oh my gosh, love that. And there is some missing numbers floating around, so we will we will see. Okay, so um, let's see. Is this number twenty three? Twenty three. Yep, pen and pencil set. Ooh, ooh, I like that. You can add this to a planner and it just holds your little pencil and pen. Was she stuck here like two pens? She, we have, ooh, I love these are small. Those are so cute. You guys know I love anything tiny. Oh my God, and the color gold. This is awesome. Definitely will be using that in my planner. Thank you so much. I love that. And then, let's see, was this number 14? Trying to make sure everything's stuck together here. 
Okay, so number 14, <laughs> I have this paper pad and I have not used any stickers from it. I've been trying to uh, save it because it's so cute, but now that I have two, I will be able to start using my other one. So this is number 14 and this one is from Michael's this paper pad, not paper pad, sticker pad. It has the cutest, I mean, we have mermaids, unicorns, anything you can think of is in the sucker. So, oh my gosh, love it, love it. Okay, and then here, 25, is paper straws. And what I'm seeing here is really cool. There is some really thin ones that you see right here, those two. How cute are those? I've never seen thin straws like that. Oh, those are so cute. I already have ideas flowing through my brain of what I can do with those. Thank you so much. All right, so this is 21, and 21 says it's embellishments. We're going to go ahead and open that up. Ooh, look how cute these are. Oh, oh. MG. Look how adorable that is. Oh my gosh. I actually have some of these little reindeers ornaments that I picked up from Walmart. Look how pretty she made this little rosette. So cute. You can actually hang it like an ornament. I love these. Um, I'm not sure where you got them. The little the snowflake pieces here those are so cute I love that let's see what else is in here oh look how cute that is it says warmest wishes I mean these are adorable love it and they all have the little string and I think that's it yeah just those two super cute you did an awesome job and so that was 21. What is this one? This one doesn't have a number. So I'm thinking this one is 16. So let me make sure. Yes. So this one is 16. And it is some glitter glue. Which I do. Um, I don't have many of these. So that is cool. And then some pearled little stickers. I like little enamel dots. Love that. So thank you so much. That was 16, number 11 is some stamped images. And I know that was one of the items as well that we had to include. And I'm not good with stamping or coloring, but I do have markers to color with that I, ha that I had gotten. So I need to practice. Esther is really good at coloring these suckers in. <laughs> so many little cutouts and shapes that I can use and gives me something to do on my downtime. So cute. Thank you so much. And like I said, everything I'm trying to keep. If I don't ruin it, I'm going to try to keep it. Love the gold and white polka dots. And then this is 19 another little envelope and then 19 are die cuts it's quite a bit in here oh a bunch of snowflakes oh my gosh this is gonna be so perfect come in handy oh we have snowflakes in like the two colors we also have some deers and then some deer heads in both colors some stockings and what else do we have oh my gosh some Christmas tree prints love these look at all these cute little snowflakes I'm loving the colors oh my gosh so pretty thank you I mean you gave me so much thank you so much this is awesome love it get that all in there all right, and let's see here. 
number 20. Oh, it's a little um, post-it kit here with a bunch of mini post-its. So cute. I can add that into my planner as well. Thank you. And then this is number four. And she says it just says plain cards. Let's see. Oh, just a bunch of different ones with the envelopes, cards and envelopes. Oh, that is awesome. Thank you so much. We got some plain ones. I can decorate and do my own style. Oh, look at this one. This is pretty girl. Thank you so much for sharing with me. This is awesome. Love that. Absolutely love it. That was four. And we're coming down to the end. We have number two, which is washi samples. And this was another um, work requirement to include. Oh, look at that. So cute. Oh, I have it backwards or upside down. Oh my gosh. These are so pretty. And I do not have any of these. So, so pretty. Thank you so much. Jasmine, this was so cool. I definitely enjoyed opening everything. Oh my gosh. Such a fun idea. I've never done, done this before. <laughs> And then let's see, I'm going to say Goody Mix. This is number 17 Goody Mix. And it just has a bunch of random items that I can um, craft with. We have some foam stickers. We have some mini bows, some bells, mini tassels. You guys know I love mini bows. Oh my gosh. Love that. That is so cute. Stick that there. And then last but not least, we have number 24, which is clips. So just a bunch of, let's see, different clips here. This one's actually stayed on pretty good. Can you see that? Can't catch me. That gingerbread clip. And then we have some bows, some diamonds, like jewels, some little um, wooden clips mixture of random little clips that I can definitely use. I do like to make paper clips as well. So thank you so much, Jasmine, for this box of goodies. This was absolutely adorable. I love the idea. Like I said before, I've never made one or ever received something like this. So this was super fun for me to open. And I hope you guys enjoyed watching the video as well. And I will see you guys on my next one. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you're new here. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.